Since the dawn of eternity, four lights of hope have shone upon the world. Men flock to these lights, around which they build four peristylia. Each peristylium becomes their faith and society, the path upon which they are set. The vermilion bird, wings of fire to lift the heart. The white tiger, steely arms by which to seize knowledge. The azure dragon, unclouded eyes that see all beneath the sky. The black tortoise, a rigid shield and a well-guarded blade. But when nine and nine meet nine, Tempest Phoenix shall be willed upon them. For without the Agita, their world, called Aurians, must persist in its spiral. In this time of absolute darkness, we must unite to bring forth the light of hope. The time has come. Yes, this is the dawn of a new age. And so the Militus Empire, home to the White Peristylium, invaded the neighboring dominion of Rubrum. As soon as the declaration of war was made, the Militesi main fleet swarmed into all corners of Rubrum. At the same time, a separate fleet was charged with a sneak attack on the Vermilion Peristylium. A lassie accompanied this task force. Using a lassie to invade a sovereign state was a direct violation of the Pax Codex, a treaty created by all four crystal states of Orients. The besieged Palestilium attempted to repel Militess' Magitech armors with powerful magic. Not even the mighty warships could withstand the awesome power of the summoned Eidolans. It seemed that the Militesi offensive would fail. However, the Lassi Kunmi led a special unit past Wuburn's defenses and activated a new weapon, the Crystal Jammer, neutralizing the power of the Vermilion Bird Crystal. Severed from the source of their magical powers, the Wuburn forces were quickly overwhelmed and overrun. Imperial Marshal Sid Olstein demanded of Chancellor Kalian Cheval VI, the leader of Rubrum, that he surrender and transfer the Vermilion Bird Crystal to Militesi control. Your crystal cannot protect you. Resistance is no longer an option. You have six hours. You must comply with our demands or face the full might of our forces. In which case, I promise you, the roads of Rubrum will run red with the blood of her people. May the crystal guide them to salvation.
When nine and nine meet nine, the depths of reason shall stir. When the seal of creation is broken, a voice like thunder shall sound, and thou shalt know. We have arrived.